copied me. You copied me. You copied me. What time did you put your shoes on this morning? 6.45. Why? Why? What time did you put your shoes on this morning? What time, what time do I normally text you? I don't know. Like 6.45? I, I get up early, dog. Did you go by Urban? I didn't go by Urban. I wanted to. Because like the first day we were out there, he posted a picture with the Denver Nuggets jersey. Why the fuck did you go by there, you dumb shit? Because my lady didn't want to go out there. So what? You took her on a trip. She can't go to one fucking store. Fuck out of here. I know. Never. You're like asking for trouble for the rest of your life if you don't fucking fix that. Jesus. You got all the shoes. All the shoes everybody got. You got the same one. How did we do that? I don't think that's ever happened. Has it, Sager? No. Which, uh, where, where are you thinking? Right here. Okay. Take your shoes off you when you get started, huh? Yeah, when I get started. Get no fucking rules. Get all. Where'd that be, guys? Let's go. How's it going? Yeah, I'm going. Okay. You can step back if you'd like. Oh, here we go, right? See you. Nice to meet you. Good. Good. It's weird to see everything in person. Yeah. <laughs> You're on the set. Yeah, seriously. Challenge don't play for You know what I mean? Yeah. So you got gloves? Can you gave me some gloves. You don't want to my baby hand gloves? Are they small? Yeah. They're like super small. Do I even have gloves? Yeah. <laughs> no, I left no gloves here when I left. Oh, okay. Or I tried to detect the shit after That's why I saw my You got there too late, because now I'm. I didn't have to worry about it. That's the story being told right now. Um, yeah, it's like riding a bike, right? Once you take a break for a while, you still got it. Yeah, you're actually better. Come home, like, I worked, I kind of like hung out at this tattoo shop, like, late at night. Yeah. When me and him were like 18, 19, and then he'd either like hear me come in all late, so he'd just like, in the morning, poke his head in my door, and he'd be like, what'd you get last night? And I'd like, <laughs> so I remember the day I got this little wrist tattoo, I was like, I got my wrist tattoo. And he was like, it's all over now. He's like, you got oh, your yeah. fucking lower arms done. I was like, nah, it'll just be that little one. And then I think like two days later, I got this big ass Yoda. He was like, he's like, you're fucking crazy. Yeah. Why? Because I don't have them? No. Yeah, yeah. Nikes. What are they? Thursday. <laughs> what are they, Nikes? Yeah. Yeah, the issues with physical therapy, like putting her feet on her I just hand. wanted for the camera to knock the shit out of your hands. <laughs> so that for physical therapy, she needs her shoes. No, if she can't learn to walk and boost, she doesn't deserve to learn to walk. She's going to scoot on her butt forever. So I was so I was right. She's a good scooter. I said Nike. Yeah. 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 You look like Missy Elliott. <laughs> I look like Snoop Dogg in the Easter Bunny costume. Corner of your hair. You would look. I'm a corner of my hair. Corner of it. I would look so dope. We're gonna vote. Yeah. I'm gonna take a vote on the channel. Should I corner on my hair? Oh, what the hell? Fucking what is this? Oh shit! Come <laughs> on, time. Really? It's easy as fuck. It's gonna ink. It's gonna shoot ink. No, there's no ink in it. No, that one's got ink this in it. No, it's not. I've taken two of these out. They do this every time to me. Yeah. Uh, has a remover. Oh yeah. yeah, she works at a retail. Uh, no, they're all different. I gave Kith God so much shit that he felt bad and gave me a Kith shirt that just came in the mail. I got it. I got it. Thanks. Thanks, camera girl. But yeah, guilt. It works. You look ridiculous. <laughs> He's got a rose. <laughs> American flag rose on. And he's saying you look ridiculous. Yeah. I need to be like that. <laughs> How's Vegas, Ab? It was good. Nice. Yeah. We didn't get any meal shots. Sorry, no. I can send you guys some from my, my all of You can sleep that. when you die. $500 on dinner with us. It was 400 earlier, but. It was, it was 480. All right. I <clears throat> Okay.
So I kind of fucked up today. Uh, the main way, main way that I fucked up today was I went to work. <sighs> Hats don't stick on your head once you get your head shaved. It's so fucking velcroy. First fuck up of the day. I forgot to bring batteries for my camera. Yeah. Luckily, my client, who I did a tattoo today, which uh, people that are asking, because after I posted the tattoo, a lot of people are messaging me, asking when they can get in. Um, I'm gonna open an email this week. Again, you can get in with your tattoos. I'll be taking appointments. I'm not taking everything. I'm just taking the stuff that, um, you know, will actually make a good tattoo. Because some people have crazy ideas, and crazy ideas, I'm, I don't want, I don't want crazy ideas. Just good tattoos, or at least crazy ideas that don't work. You know, some crazy ideas make really good tattoos. But anyway, soon enough, we'll be able to talk about that. Luckily, my client, who also is, uh, watches the channel, him and his kids and his wife came through today. Super cool, he actually had batteries, because he had a cannon, so that worked out pretty good. So shout out to my man for coming through, getting tattooed, and having the batteries. I didn't have time to really do anything yet today. It's already uh, 5.30 almost. So I'm just gonna open these packages that we got. One of them I really don't know what this is. I know what this is, I don't know what this is. Uh, I did open an envelope earlier that told me I was going to hell. So yeah, that happened, but you know, it's cool. I'm not worried. So here's this little package. I think I know what this is. I do believe this is from my man Dan at Kick Posters. All right, got some stickers. Ooh, we got the the signature sticker and hologram sticker. Nice, these are fire. Shout out to Dan for those. And then it looks like all one, two, three, five, six of these limited edition cards they're doing. So here's the heart. NMD R1 is the gazelle. EQT support, double up, past and present. The Ultra boost. Olive green colorway, it looks like. And then we have some Superstar 80s. So these cards, paperwork. Uh, all right, so this has been alive for a, little, a couple of months. Uh, Dan tried to send me this stuff before, but it just, I lost, it didn't make it to me in the mail. And so basically with paperwork, so these six cards, if you live and you can order off of Adidas dot EU and the European Adidas, you can get any of these cards. They're inserted at random, your order, uh, you never know which one you're gonna get, but if you keep ordering, you can collect them all. The heart one is the most limited one and is also numbered zero, zero, zero. Focus! Focus. Focus. All right, fuck it, you see the zero. But yeah, so shout out to Dan for sending me all six, that's awesome, I will hold on to these. If you would like to win, or receive, I guess, these. All you need to do is place your order in the EU and one of these will be inside of your box. Uh, doesn't say when it's gonna end. Doesn't sound like it's gonna end anytime soon. So yeah, nice little addition to your regular order. I feel like most people are already ordering a few shoes a month anyway. Shout out to Dan for sending those out. Much appreciated. Super appreciate the love. There's also this URL in the back and you can see which ones are available, which ones you don't have. Etc. Etc. So good luck if you're into them. I've seen a lot of people posting these on Twitter and stuff. So people are I've been getting them. So you may already know about this. Let's see what's in these boxes. Let's see what's in the box that I don't know what it is. And the reason this box is confusing me is because it's from Boulder Running, which I haven't ordered anything from Boulder Running that I'm aware of. That is located in Denver, Colorado. So. And it's on first. It's like down the street. I don't have a blade near me. A blade, a blade, a blade. Let's check it out. It's a pair of Ultra Boosts. It doesn't make sense. If this is the shoe I think it is, it really, really doesn't make sense. I, it, I don't remember what company I ordered it from, but I ordered it from a different fucking company. It's yeah, I ordered it from Jackrabbit. I said, how does this even make sense? It's the shoe that I thought, but why did it come from Denver? All right, see, so yeah, I know this is, which, what was the name of this colorway? The, uh, I don't remember what they were calling it. Okay, Trace Olive. So we got this one in the mail today, which is really nice. I really like the upper. Not what I expected it to be, but this is it. Uh, there's some similar colorways to this that just dropped. The only difference is this one has a leather cage, I believe, and this one has more of a brown look to it. But we'll, uh, I'll compare the, I'll compare, 
I'll compare those uh, olive green colorways very soon for you. As soon as we get through all the boxes. This right here is from Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Chinese label in the front. Chinese label. One point oh. Multi color. Mm -mm -mm. Beautiful. So I finally got the one point oh multi color. These are super dope. Super super dope. Uh, I don't know how many pairs of these were made. I feel like DJ Khaled said there was only 500 pairs in a Snapchat once, but DJ Khaled says some wild shit. Um, cool, but well, that's what we got in the mail. Sweet mail day, and they are real, so that's a positive as well. Positive, cool. So a uh, quick review on the Multicolor 1.0. Uh, Alright, so this is a shoe I've been looking for for forever. I, like I said, there was like it's limited, I know, but I don't know how limited. I don't think 500 pairs sounds right to me, but I guess you never know. And I know that it was a bitch finding my pair. Finally, some people tagged me in an Instagram post and I copped. So shout out to everybody that tags me and stuff when they know I don't have it. It's super cool and very helpful. It's much appreciated. But so this is what the shoe looks like. Multicolor 1.0. The biggest, uh, god damn, it's like washed out like crazy. Yeah, you can see better now, shit. All right, so that's the 1.0 multicolor. Looks a lot like a triple white ultra boost with just what they were calling, I believe, rainbow weave, I do believe is the name they called this, the rainbow weave toe box. That's really the big difference. Most people will say this looks just like the 1.0 Ultra Boost, which I don't necessarily think that it does in all regards. Openings in the toe box um, and basically all throughout the PK are definitely different. In the back end, and because it's a 1.0, the back end is mesh, so that's, that's normal. Silver and gold Ultra Boost branding. Boost, and then this is a 1.0 that actually does have a continental sole. So some people even call that 2.0, but it's, it's still 1.0. Um, white laces, white, 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 rainbow. Pretty much it. Like the shoe is very plain, very simple, but definitely one that I absolutely wanted to add to my collection. Uh, regular plastic TPU cages, black insole, it's flipped. And then for a nice comparison, I went ahead and dug out the triple white 1.0 to show you the difference. These are a little dirty, but there's also a very big difference uh, in the uppers in general. This has like, actually, I'm missing a pair of these too. I have a dead stock pair of these that came in. I wonder where those went. Man, I'm missing so much shit. I'm never leaving again. But there is a huge difference because the 1.0 has cream stitched into the toe box and all throughout the shoe, whereas the uh, multicolor is just pure straight up white. So, I mean, there's really, it's really easy to see. These do have a little dinge to them because they have been worn quite a bit. Um, as far as finding these, good luck, I don't know. Resale, I paid quite a bit. I paid like 500 bucks for this because I can never find my size. And then these are actually a 12 and a half, which as you guys know, if I could take the insole out, I can still wear them. So um, that's what I'm gonna do. Glad to finally add these to the collection. I can stop searching. I'm pretty much running out of 1.0s to get. There's not much left. I'm looking for like the JDs for a good price. People gotta stop hitting me up for the same pair of JDs for over a thousand dollars. I'm not paying it. It's just not happening. Um, and just a couple other random things just in my size, but definite grail. Definitely glad I copped. That's the uh, multicolor 1.0 Ultra Boost. <laughs>